Hi, scholars. So today we're going to um, talk about triangles. Um, so the first thing that we're going to do is read a book together. I found this one on Epic that we can read, and I'm going to read it out loud to you, and we're going to look at what makes up a triangle and all the different kinds of triangles, um, and then we're going to do a quick sort. So let's see what our book says. Triangles. A triangle has three sides. It has three angles, and we can see we can count one, two, three sides, and then the angles are right here in the corners. One corner angle, two, and three. This shape is found all over. Do you see the triangles in the picture, scholars? All of those flags are triangles, huh? They are in windows, see right there, and roofs. See how the, the roof is kind of angled like a triangle? They are cut in pie. It is easier to share. See the yellow piece over there and then the actual piece of pumpkin pie looks like it's a triangle. They are on boats. They are the sails. They help move the boats. You can see that triangle there, the sails in that shape. They are on bridges. They make them stronger. See the blue one. They are in music. Kate plays the triangle. Do you see our friend Kate there? She has a triangle and that's her musical instrument. Cut a rectangle in half and it makes two triangles. So scholars, we can see one, two, three, four sides. That whole piece of paper is a rectangle with four sides. But if we cut it in half diagonally, we can see that that makes one blue triangle and another yellow triangle. Look around you, you will find a triangle. See on the jungle gym, there's one. So you can look, scholars, if you wanna check out this picture and you can count. Look at how many triangles there are in this picture. Now, some of these blocks are rectangles and cylinders and squares, um, but there are lots and lots of little triangles, so see if you can count them. Um, now, scholars, you can also see that this has a little bit of a glossary, which means it tells you the important academic words, just kind of like when we have the lips on our um, posters and stuff. So what I want to share with you is a another poster that we can look at together. So um, let's see. So this one says, get to know the triangle. A triangle has three sides three sides. So you can see the little red line shows you kind of where one of those sides is, and we can count one, two, three, all the way around. A triangle has three points. Now we called them angles before, and those things are right always on the corners. You can see one, two, three corners or points, and that's where we find the angles. That's how open those corners are or closed. And then you can see that the triangle is a closed shape. Right, scholars? So we talked about is the shape closed or is it open? Now that means that all of our points are touching, it means all the sides are meeting at, at points instead of having an open piece or like a space. So triangles are closed shapes and all three of our lines touch and make those points. So scholars, if you can look at the camera where it shows me, I'm gonna, we're gonna do a little uh, sorting game really quickly. So for example, you can see this triangle is, well, why don't you tell me, is it closed or is it open? You're right, it is closed. There is no space. All of our lines connect on our three points. So one, two, three sides, and one, two, three points. Great, now you're gonna help me sort. I have two more and I want you to help me decide. Is this shape, a closed shape. No, it's not, because we can see our point here and our point here, but these two sides do not touch to make a point. There is a space, so it is an open shape. Very good. Okay, I have one more for you scholars. Let's see, is this shape open or closed? Very good. 
it is closed because all three of our points are touching. Our sides all meet into those three points and it is a closed shape. This is actually a true triangle. All right, very good scholars. So that's gonna be your job today on Seesaw. You're gonna be sorting some triangles and we will talk to you soon. I can't wait to see what you did on Seesaw.